Hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to the workshop, or if it's your first time, just welcome to the workshop. The sneakers that we have today are fire. But before we get into that, some of you may know, some of you may not, but we have started our very own podcast. This is like our passion project right now. It's something that we've wanted to do for a long time, and now we are doing it. It is official every Tuesday, there will be a brand new podcast episode. So far, we are two episodes in, so it's brand new. And actually, episode two just dropped yesterday. It'll be on iTunes soon, Spotify, the whole shebang. But right now, it is only on SoundCloud. We will put a link in the description. Go check it out and let us know what you think. We're very excited about it, and so we want to share it with you and hear your feedback and your thoughts on said podcast. On that note, let's talk some sneakers. These definitely need a drum roll. Drum roll, please. Bang, bang. The Nike SB Dunk Purple Lobster by Concepts. Fuego. These are insane. They really are. They released about a week ago and retail was 130 bucks. They are selling for about double that now, which isn't too bad, all things considered, considering the hype and all that stuff behind them. Shouts to Kixar for us for looking out as they always do. If you're in the Tampa area, make sure you check them out. They have a store in the International Mall. They also have a store in the University Mall. For those of you who are not local, we will put their info in the description so you can check them out through the social media and whatnot now the purple lobster it's buzzing and it's funny because it's like wait a minute myself included wait a minute are nike sbs back there was the diamond supply dunks and maybe that was like kind of the warm-up prior to that sbs have been dead for a while now let me clarify because i know i'll have someone ready to break a skateboard over my head in the comments when i say dead i only mean yeah because let's really define this dead meaning devoid or absent of hype no hype around the product i have homies who skate i'm not disrespecting skateboarding skate culture that's never been dead in fact skate culture is buckets you and i talk about it all the time skate culture is like one of the most like united like there's so much i don't even know what the right word is there's so much loyalty or like solidarity in that it's a lot of culture there there is a ton of culture there so skate culture not dead at all but nike sbs speaking to the sneaker heads or the sneaker masses has been dead that hype just has it hasn't been there now for this shoe they lined up they camped out i felt like i time traveled back a few years and that's the definition of hype so let me also say these deserve the hype amazing sneaker perfectly executed by concepts it's a purple shoe obviously but there are some different shades and textures i love the swoosh it's got like a little shine to it and although i wish they kept the inside red like the samples had. I still love that purple and white checkered lining, white tongue, Nike SB front and center, black midsole, purple bottoms, extra laces, and extra lobster bands because anything else quite frankly, would be uncivilized. They just did a great job with these. So are Nike SBs back? Are they? I'd say they have the potential to come back, but I wouldn't say they're back just yet. Coming back, perhaps, we'll have to see. What's Nike gonna do? I mean, come on, let's face it. Nike knows how to hype something up and market it. They understand all of that. They're Nike. So if they put the same energy into Nike SB as they did several years ago, then hell yeah, they'll be back. They'll be back in full force. Personally, I've liked Dunks for a long time. Who remembers our first YouTube video where we reviewed or I reviewed the Nike SB Skunks and also the Crown Royals on a dirty picnic bench, the good old days. So I've liked Dunks, but I wouldn't say I'm a crazy Nike SB fan or anything. I'm always gonna gravitate towards the basketball stuff more than the skateboarding stuff because I'm a basketball player, not a skateboarder. Let's also clarify this. I'm not one of these people that thinks you need to be able to do a kickflip in order to wear a pair of Nike SBs. And I'm not 
the type of person that thinks you need to be able to dunk to wear a pair of LeBrons. I've always had my favorite Nike SBs, you know, my five, 10 pairs that I'm in love with, some of which I will never own, sad realities, but I'm not just accumulating a ton of SBs and I never have the way I have done with other sneakers. These are fire though. I actually didn't expect to like them as much as I do. Seeing them in hand, no brainer. They are that good. I wish I could skate. I think it would be awesome to see a video of someone actually skating in these. I mean, shredding them up. You have performance, tests for basketball sneakers need some skate tests on youtube for nike sbs how do you feel or maybe they already exist and i just don't know about them how do you feel about these though do you think nike sbs are back it's a valid it's a legitimate question i know there's gonna be a lot of people screaming they never left maybe they never left for you that's fair and that's completely fine but for the masses for the sneaker masses they definitely did leave i mean that's just a fact so let us know though, for you, do you think they're coming back? Do you think this is kind of, you know, with the diamond supply release and then these, do you think it's kind of just, you know, a couple shining moments and then it's gonna kind of taper back off or do you think they're back? Just leave a comment and let us know. It's something that I'm very kind of curious to hear what all you have to say about it. And we just always love to hear from you anyway, regardless. Thank you for watching. We appreciate the shit out of you. We'll be back tomorrow, same time, same place right here at the workshop. We will have a brand new video for you, fresh out of the oven cooked up on a platter for you. See you later.